so guys it's cat and i'm back with another litty bitty for you guys today so as you guys can tell that it, ugh, as you guys can tell by that title today i am going to be giving you guys five things i did this year that was going to put me on the nice list and also five things that i did that is going to put me on the naughty list what i'm gonna do i'm gonna go ahead and tell you guys pretty much what i did this year and let you guys determine if i should be on the naughty list or the nice list basically right if you guys think i should be on the naughty list go ahead and leave a comment if you guys think i should be on the nice list by the end of this video go ahead and leave a comment as well and then you know but before we get into that definitely make sure you go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you are new turn on your post notifications so you guys can be notified every time i do upload like this video comment on this video share this video and get that's it okay guys so i'm gonna start with naughty number one on my naughty list is twerking at church i remember <laughs> i remember going to church with my mom and then uh yeah basically it is what it sounds like somebody had ended up playing a beat king song at church with had with they had no business playing no beat king song at church that's they fault me and some of the other kids was basically in like the back room of the church and we was all back there twerking 12 years old like 11 10 11 12 years old and had no business listening to that or twerking at church but yeah that's number one on my naughty list so the next one is going to be a nice one on the nice side um i ended up holding the elevator for somebody while i was late to work so i don't know how like you have those people who kind of just like constantly push the button like close 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 that's definitely me so for me to be late and i actually saw somebody coming and i held the elevator for them i feel like that deserves to go on a nice list that should put me on a nice list for sure second one on my naughty list is going to be laughing at a kid falling so it was like this little kid who was at target um kind of just like screaming running around punching his mom doing all types of crazy stuff like it was really ridiculous like the mom had zero control and she was just like Connor you need to stop Connor you need to stop you need to calm down and he's like shut up and then he runs by and then he runs by and punches her in the stomach I thought that was crazy but after he punched his mom in the stomach he ends up turning the corner and running directly into somebody's basket and ends up like falling right on like falling on his butt and then he just started to cry and I don't know that kind of made me chuckle <laughs> number two on my nice list is going to be buying a lady gas now so for y'all who don't know I do like women as much as I like men. So I just saw this lady, um, really cute. <laughs> she was really cute, but um, she was uh, trying to pay for gas. At, um, she was trying to pay for gas and basically her card kept declining. I don't know what was going on. But, you know, I just stepped up and I was just like, hey, you know, um, like how much is it? She was just like, no, it's only tw it's $20, but you know, you don't have to do that. And I was just like, no, you know, you're fine. I got you. <laughs> so I ended up paying for her gas. She was like, oh yeah, thank you, thank you. Um, Yeah, I feel like that, <laughs> I feel like that deserves to put me on the nice list, paying for somebody gas. Number three on my naughty list is going to be teaching my daughter how to point up the middle finger my daughter was probably like two years old and she i don't know what was going on but i remember like my daughter was very sweet she's still very sweet but she was very sweet and she was letting a lot of kids like push on her or whatever i ain't like that what i did um was i taught her how to kind of just like push back you know just only for self-defense purposes and then i ended up um teaching her how to do the middle finger or whatever so for a little while she was walking around just like <clears throat> kind of just like pointing it at everybody but yeah um i taught her how to do the middle finger when she was about two years old so i feel like that's naughty list worthy number three on my nice list is going to be giving my brother my last 30 dollars. so he ended up texting me and he was just like hey you know i need some money for something i don't remember what it was and he asked for it like hey do you have about like do you have like 30 dollars that i could borrow and i was just like yeah you know what forget it yeah i got you and I ended up sending it like I ended up sending it kind of without checking or without looking at it and I sent it and I was like wait a minute I think I only had $30 left check my bank account and I only had like 45 cents in that joint <laughs> of course I didn't ask him to send it back or anything like that I was just like you know what forget it he probably needed more than I do I get paid in like a couple of days anyway I'll just cook I'll just bring lunch for the next couple of days but yeah number four on my naughty list is going to be eating day old McDonald's <laughs> eating McDonald's in general should definitely put you on a naughty list I ended up getting really drunk one night and uh ended up going to McDonald's the night before woke up with a really bad hangover and kind of just walked in the kitchen and looked and I was just like dang is that McDonald's 
dang, wait a minute, I think there's McDonald's in there. I kind of just looked at it and I saw I had like a um a little double cheeseburger in there and I was just like, yeah, let me go ahead and toss this bad boy in the microwave. Yeah, so I ended up eating that. Number four on my nice list is going to be uh, giving a homeless man $20. So, you know how like you pull up at a light and it's like a homeless guy with a sign saying like, hey, you know, I just need help right now or whatever. So yeah, I was gonna go ahead and help him. I told him that I didn't really have anything, but you know, I just looked at my purse and I kind of just checked. I think I had gotten a bonus from the job that I was at at that time. And I only had a $20 bill on me. So at first I was going to be like, Ugh, no, I only got a 20. But I was just like, hey, you know, why not? I just put groceries in my house. A fridge is full. Gas tank is full. I just got a nice little bonus, bro. Here you go. Here's $20. Get you something to eat. And number five on my naughty list is going to be giving a friend advice to cheat. This particular friend, um, her dude was basically like... He was outside so i was just like it had been a few a couple of years and i was just like okay well at this point what we crying for sis what we crying for get a man to take his own medicine if he gonna be outside we're gonna be outside if he gonna be over there we're gonna be over there and that just is what that is so yeah probably <laughs> the advice i probably should have gave her is like girl drop it leave but he had did something in particular i was just like Oh, okay. What are we doing to him? Because I know he don't think, baby, I'm not sorry for it. I did that. Mm -hmm. And number five on my nice list, last but not least, I ended up letting a 18-wheeler over in front of me. Mm -hmm. If y'all are from Texas, y'all know how Texans drive. Nobody's letting an 18-wheeler over like nobody. You just gonna have to wait it out, my boy. If you've been sitting there for five minutes, you've just been sitting there for five minutes in, in traffic and that just is what that is my dad is a trucker so i ended up at first i like kind of just sped up and i wasn't gonna let him over but then i thought about it i was just like you know what my dad's a trucker i'm sure he got to deal with this all freaking day so i was just like you know what uh clear let the lane kind of just clear out a little bit and i was just like come on over bro it was one of those situations where i'm sure he had been sitting there for like five or ten minutes or something like that it looked like he'd been sitting there for a while I, I could see it in his face like in his rear view he was pissed so that probably made his day so yeah that's pretty much all i got <laughs> for my naughty list and my nice list leave in the comments if you think that i deserve to be on santa's naughty list this year or um santa's nice list I think I deserve to be on the nice list because I don't feel like my naughty list was like too horrible. So yeah. But again, I'm gonna let y'all be the judge of that. If you guys like this video, definitely make sure you go ahead and press that like button. Subscribe to my channel if you are new. Again, go ahead and turn on those post notifications so you guys can be notified every time I do upload. We are now on day four of Vlogmas. Yay! Um, still don't have a calendar. Still don't got nothing to put behind me. This is still the same scene. We'll figure something out. If it's not this Vlogmas, it'll be next Vlogmas. But yeah, it is like 10 o'clock. I just made dinner. I just got out the shower. I just put my kids to bed. And now I'm about to go eat, edit this video, and go to sleep. Love you guys so much. I really do appreciate all the support. And I will see y'all tomorrow. Peace.